everyone gather in, if you will, in a circle right, right here. We don't want to get in the way of these guys' work, obviously. That's important stuff today. We are uh, called to do three things at this stop. First, we will remember the names of, of those who have been lost in violence, either physical violence or actual death. I will lead us in a time, that, that time in just a moment. Then I'll reflect very briefly on otherizing in our world. And then finally, I would like to close with a prayer from Dr. King himself. It's appropriate that we're gathered here. It's sort of a metaphor, I suppose, to have this scripture from the Bible, which is attributed to Dr. King, but of course we know comes from our, our Hebrew scriptures originally, and yet there is no water flowing on this fountain today. And that is a bit of a Good Friday metaphor, I suppose, in its own, yes? We have already experienced this morning at our last stop the power of naming names. Yes, the power of saying names. The ancient rabbis had a saying. They said that we actually die as people three times. The first time when we take our last breath. The second time when our remains are buried or laid to rest. And the final time is when someone says our name for the last time. And so it is that we come here to name names this day to acknowledge those who have been lost by violence. Domestic violence, the violence of war. We will name those who have been lost uh, internationally in the world. Then we will come to a time where we name those who have been lost in our, in our nation. And then finally name the names of those lost either in our state or in our local community. We have some, would you like to pass those out? We have some uh, pictures. These are children who have been lost to uh, gun violence and we will remember them as a part of our litany this day. And so I would invite you to a time of prayer, open-eyed or head bowed, whatever is comfortable for you. And after each section, first the nation been here every Good Friday for five, six years. Um, apparently it's not going to work today. So um, we're going to be nonviolent and move on to the next stop and, and reconvene there. <laughs> 